morning. Police have made an arrest in Saturday's Independence Center shooting that left two people injured and sent them all into lockdown. Zach Tecklenburg joins us live in Independence now with more details on this. Zach, what can you tell us now? Well, Zhao Zhao, the man who is charged with the shooting out at the Independence Center this past Saturday, made his first initial court appearance in Jackson County Court. We want to go right to the video. We were there when 22-year-old Eric Bratton of Kansas City, Missouri, made his way into the Jackson County Courthouse annex here in Independence. He was charged with assault and armed criminal action. Uh, if if uh, he could face a maximum of life in prison, and he's currently being held on uh, cash only, $500,000, half a million dollars bond. In Jackson County. Now, this all goes back to this uh, past Saturday when officials tell us that um, in the evening hours at the Independence Center Mall, there was a shooting in the out in the walkway near the Sears, and there was uh, some sort of altercation or fight. We don't know exactly what led up to it, but we do know that uh, it left two teenagers injured. But they are expected to make um, make a recovery, and we do know now that 22-year-old Eric Bratton of Kansas City, Missouri, is the one accused of being the person who pulled the trigger now we don't know exactly he didn't say exactly much in court didn't give too much uh shed too much light into what happened that day but the judge you could tell was very upset with uh with the person in front of him he said stay away from the independent center he had very little little um little patience for this suspect and he will be staying away from the independent center because again he is behind bars right now with a half a million dollar bond and we do know that his next court hearing will be february 1st and of course we will be there again 22 year old eric bratton of kansas city missouri charged with assault and armed criminal action in regards to this saturday shooting at the independent center reporting live in independence zach tecklenburg nbc action news